What's going on guys, T-Mart here, and today I'm excited to bring you guys some gameplay of the airship in Battlefield 1. So there's a new class of vehicles that they've added in this year called Behemoth Vehicles, and there are three options that you are going to be able to be the pilot of, okay? So number one is the airship, which we're going to be checking out in this video. Number two is an armored train, and then number three is a battleship. Now, we haven't really seen the armored train or the battleship yet, but uh, we do have some gameplay here of the airship from the Battlefield Squad's live stream that just went down. And uh, you guys can see, this thing's enormous. It's a giant Zeppelin blimp with a bunch of different turrets and stuff like that on the sides that allow you and your teammates to shoot down on the enemies. And obviously, it's very, very effective. It's got a lot of firepower, and uh, it's just, it's an absolute beast. Now, the thing is, the trade-off with that is this thing is a very, very easy target to shoot at. You guys can see how big it is, how slow it is. I mean, this thing is fully controllable. Like, you can control where this thing goes, but it's so slow that anybody on the battlefield is going to be able to shoot you and take you down. So you guys can see throughout this gameplay that, uh, you know, they will take it down and it's going to end up falling to the ground, which is really, really cool. Little side note here, this guy spawned into the Zeppelin and then use that as kind of like a method to get down towards the ground. He jumped out, parachuted down to the ground, got in the objective, and killed an enemy, which I thought was really cool. But anyway, this is the little kind of like cutscene where they actually destroy this blimp. And uh, you guys can see it kind of like slowly falls. It'll give you time to, you know, try to jump out of it and, you know, parachute down to your safety and stuff like that. But the real key here is is that this can fall anywhere. This isn't like a pre-programmed area for this thing to fall. Whenever it's destroyed, it will fall. It'll fall to the ground in a big fiery blast, and it will destroy all of the buildings and area that it falls on. So you guys get to see, after it's all done, smoking and smoldering and stuff like that, there's a kind of skeleton of what was left of all this burnt metal and, you know, burnt blimp siding. I don't know what to call it, like the, like, plastic material on the side. I don't even know what it is, but yeah, yeah, the, the like remnants of this crashed blimp are laid on the map. They've destroyed the buildings in that area and it then becomes a part of the map. So now you have to move through that and it's kind of like a, a, a barricade in a way. It's another playable area that will drop anywhere on the map, no matter where it ends up being destroyed and falls down to the ground. So I, just, I thought this was really, really cool. It's our first look at these behemoths. They've obviously kind of shown a lot of this blimp and teased a lot of this blimp in the trailers and advertisements up until this point. So this is our first look at it. I figure you guys want to see it. And uh, you know, this isn't the only thing. There are also armored trains on other maps to be able to take control of the land and on some maps, there are battleships, so you can control the sea. So uh, you've got air with the giant airship, you've got land with the train, and you've got sea with the battleships. I just, I think it's going to be really, really cool. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to see some more multiplayer gameplay of Battlefield 1, make sure to check that out right here. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.